Welcome back to Weekend at One. Isiolo Senator Mohamed Kuti has condemned an incident where one person died during a presidential event this week. He is blaming his rivals in the Isiolo gubernatorial contest for the incident which left one person dead. Let's listen in to what he had to say. Our supporters, after the crowd dispersed uh, when the president left, were led by my uh, deputy governor, uh, and they had their own address separately, and they left peacefully, and they went home. It is the supporters of Honorable Bahari and the supporters of Governor Doyo uh, who clashed. I want this matter to be put very clear. Our supporters uh, met below on my billboard. They sang, they were addressed, and they left. But these two uh, team of Doyo uh, and, and Bahari, uh, who continued rallying late into the evening, uh, are the ones who clashed. And they are the ones uh, whose, in, whose supporters got involved in this incident. Therefore, I want this to be on record that the supporters of uh, this team, they were addressed immediately after the president left and they were dispersed and they went home. Uh, I also want to address the issue of some uh, leaders who look already charged. As we were preparing for the president's arrival in the morning, there was debate about this is only jubilee function, why affiliate parties and independents are being allowed. And there was a lot of heated debate. It took a whole long time. I don't know whether this has anything to do with that. And uh, there was serious anger among those who felt the president could only be addressing them and not other people. I think people should also mature. This is uh, uh, the president is looking for his votes. He wants all of us. And we need all of us to have our local competition, uh, and that should not uh, make the president uh, lose any votes, because we all want to support him at the level of the presidency. There is no presidential candidate in Isiolo. Therefore, we need a presidential candidate, and we want to support His Excellency the President's re-election. Re and therefore, they should not make it difficult for the president uh, getting uh, votes from independents candidates from supporters of uh, other uh, uh, parties that are affiliated to Jubilee by trying to elbow people out. And I think the president showed a lot of uh, maturity, a lot of uh, uh, master of uh, politics by putting all of us together and saying these are your, your children, uh, you vote anyone you want to support, and anyone you vote for will be, out, uh, will be mine when they come to whatever position that you elect them to. But as for me, please give me the votes across the board. And that is how a mature politics, politician should behave, and, and we should support that. Uh, and therefore.